My name is Mariah Medina. I'm the Public Affairs Manager for the San Antonio Police Department. This critical incident video release is intended to provide you with information as the department currently understands it about an officer involved shooting that occurred at the San Antonio International Airport on April 15th of 2021. San Antonio Police Lieutenant Jesse Salamate will show you relevant video and walk you through related dispatch and 911 audio. You will also hear more about police procedures that are relevant to the facts of this incident as we know them so far. Content of this video may not be suitable for all audiences. Viewer discretion is advised. At approximately 2.30 p.m., a park police officer who was working at the airport encountered a man driving the wrong way on the lower drop-off and pickup terminals. Although the officer was equipped with a body-worn camera, due to the circumstances, he was unable to activate it. Here is a relevant portion of the airport surveillance video illustrating that moment. The driver is seen traveling against traffic. The officer is then seen approaching the driver, then running toward the car as the driver parks in the B terminal. The suspect, identified as Joe Gomez, is then seen promptly getting out of his car and opening fire. Here is a secondary view of the shooting that shows Gomez fire in the direction of vehicles and people around him. Bystanders are seen taking cover. Later, Gomez is seen reloading. We received a number of calls about a shooter at the airport. Here is a portion of the 911 audio from the incident. San Antonio 911, this is Jessica. Do you need police, fire, or EMS? Hi, there's um, a police um, shooting at the airport. They're at the airport, there's someone shooting. When Gomez began firing, the officer took cover behind a column and returned fire, wounding the suspect. The suspect is then seen returning to his car before kneeling on the ground and turning the gun on himself. We are not showing this portion of the video. Gomez was taken to University Hospital where he was pronounced deceased. The Bear County Medical Examiner determined Gomez died from a self-inflicted gunshot wound. While Gomez fired several rounds, no one was seriously injured. Investigations into deadly force are comprehensive and can take over a year. A reminder, this is our current understanding of the situation and could change as investigators gather more information. The San Antonio Police Department does not make any determinations as to whether procedures were followed until all facts are known. All officer-involved shootings are forwarded to the Bear County District Attorney's Office for review. As of this publication, the investigation remains ongoing.